Hello mates, welcome back to Simply Whitby. We're at the top of the paddock steps and we're going to Botham's today. Uh, it's on Skinner Street, it's the main one. They've got one down on, um, my wife's made me a few notes, Mrs M. Uh, oh, she's chirping in already, you know, she don't want to be on screen but she wants to chirp. Uh, family Bakers, started by Elizabeth Botham, 150 years ago. She's dead now. <laughs> yeah, okay, thank you. It's pronounced Bothams. Honestly. Uh, they were selling uh, bread and cakes from uh, a basket. Yeah. And then... A... No. No. Stop it now, please. You're ruining it. Stop it. You're ruining it. I'm, I'm, I'm actually doing this. Elizabeth Stop it. Botham used to sell bread and cakes from a basket. And then she bought Skinner Street Shop. And that's where we're going. Is that it? 150 years ago, 1865. Right, let's go. Uh, if you don't want to be on this, I suggest uh, you're busy on. Honestly. Ruins, she absolutely ruins these videos. I'm not kidding. <laughs> You'll be on it. There's no point in creeping around there. Right, come on chums, let's get up here. Let's see what's happening. So we're in the paddock. I should have put my uh, lens cover on, shouldn't I? My ND filter. Uh, we're going to get a wristband done today, so uh, that'll be nice, won't it? Um, and uh, I'll put that somewhere. I think I'm going to hide one where I've hidden one before behind the post box. Uh, but we'll see. So we're going to have a wonder up. We're coming up the paddock and uh, I'm going to get in the shade a bit. So uh, yeah, that's a bit better, isn't it? I'll have a look up here. Then we're going up Hunter Street. For you uh, lovely people who know Whitby, you'll, uh, you'll know this, up the paddock steps through the paddock, up onto Hunter Street. And uh, yeah, I'll show you, I've done a video here before. Uh, hang on, this is Hunter Street. And that's Lush Coffee. We've done a review there. Very nice in Lush Coffee. I like it. Hunter Street. I got that. Yes. Right, let's get off. I've got somebody following me at the moment. You know what else to say then, Mrs. M? I think you could think of somewhere more imaginative than the post box. All right. I'll, my bangle, it isn't a bangle, it's a wristband. It's not it a bangle. The bangles were a girl's band. The bangles. Right, I'm going to get over the road here because. It's a bit congested. Here we go. This is Skinner Street. It has, yeah. Should have gone into Cranberry Swamp, shouldn't we? We'll do that another day. Dispensary there. I like the dispensary. And here we are. Can you see uh, established 1865 Bottoms Bakery? So uh, we're going to get up here, I'm going to film the shop and then I'm going to swap my cameras over and get on to my neck break. Excuse me, can you stop butting in? <sighs> they can't hear you. Our friends can't hear you, can you? I don't know. I've got the microphone. Do you want the microphone? No. Right, okay. Oh, it's steampunk, here we are. Here's Elizabeth Bottoms. It's not a bad view, is it? So we can cross her over without getting run over. And then uh, here we go. I don't know what that is. Huh? Ancient coffee maker. Right, here we are. Elizabeth Bottoms. Let's switch this camera off. And uh, there's a star lift for um People can't get up the okay, that's a good point. That is a good point. Yeah, do they take dogs? I don't think no. No, no, no dogs. No dogs allowed. And have they got any Wi Fi connection? I don't think they have. No, I don't think so. Okay, there's a lady behind you. She's coming in. Right. <laughs> Bottoms upstairs opening hours there for your mates. Please check out our menu on the next window. So let's have a look. There we are. There's the menu, but we'll show you a close up of that when we get inside. They don't do the kippers anymore, do they, no, Mrs. M? they used to do lovely 
full English and they also used to do lovely egg and chips, but they don't <laughs> do them anymore. Yeah. Homemade chips, one then when you put yeah. the when you put the vinegar on, you could smell that hot vinegar oh, on the chips. It were gorgeous. <laughs> it were gorgeous. Right, let's shut off and let's get up the stairs. Right, let's get up these stairs and let's get in. People coming down, people coming up. Thank you. Welcome to our tea room. Oh, it's old fashioned in here, isn't it? Bottoms upstairs. Oh, look at those plants. Hello. Yeah, I'm looking for. Oh, here she is. Look at this. Fantastic, isn't it? Isn't it lovely? cakes right let's sit down and uh, have a look at the menu right mates here we are put the microphone down here so you can hear mrs m she wants to chirp in and upset the apple cart uh, and in the meantime i'm going to show you the uh, I'm going to show you the menu. Let's have a look. Uh, I'm going to do this on my phone. Yes. Yes. On my phone. I've got my shorts on, by the way. It's because I've got good legs. I told you that, then. <laughs> it's the last time I'm bringing you. Honestly, it's the last time I'm bringing you. It's not happening. Uh, no, not just yet. Uh, I'll only be a second. Thank you. I'm going to have a hot milk steamer. Hot milk steamer? Mm. And what does that um, involve? It's a mug of hot What's steamed milk with a choy soft syrup, and I'm going to put it and nutmeg. To a 95. I'm going to have a house coffee wow. because the coffee in here is gorgeous. Let's turn this over. Uh, and what are you having uh, to eat? I'm going to have a toasted sandwich, and I'm going to have mature cheddar and baked beans. Wow. Right, um, I was going, oh yeah, I don't know what I'm doing here. Anyway, it doesn't matter, I'm going to film the menu again because this very point. Right, so tell me again what you're having. I'm having a hot steamer yep. and I'm having cheese and beans in a toasted sandwich. Okay, I'm going to have the uh, bottoms pork pie and onion marmalade. How does that sound? Oh, that yes, nice. please. What drinks can I get for you guys? Can I have a steamer, please, with um, honey and nutmeg? nutmeg. Lovely, um, and so. And then, can I have a toasted sandwich with cheese and baked beans, please? Yeah, I'll just put the other drink in first and I'll get I'll have the, um, mm. uh, the afternoon tea blend, actually. I'm afraid we don't have that one okay. available in the loose leaf, but everything else in uh, the loose leaf. Have you got a first flush on here? Actually, the first flush, second flush. I thought you were having coffee. No, I've decided to have something else. I'll have the, um, the English breakfast, then. English breakfast with milk or lemon? Lemon, please. Yes, there's a cheese and beans toasted sandwich. Yes, please. And um, would you like that on white honey or country grain? I'll have country grain, please. Is it? And anything sweet, sir? Uh, uh, did I say pork pie and the marmalade? The light bite? Yeah. Thanks Thank a lot. You Thank you. Thank you. That should be nice, eh? Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Yeah, me too. I'm very, very hungry. I had my breakfast at six this morning. Oh, yeah. <sighs> So it's changed a bit in here now, hasn't it? 
Have you seen the other room? It's, it's lovely there. Yeah, it always does. Uh, yeah. Yes, nice. Thanks I very much. I think it was <laughs> when... Um, no, it's all right. It's all right, isn't it? I think yeah. it was when... Uh, yeah, thank you. Thank at, you. At the lockdown that, that stopped doing the... The cooked food. Yeah, it's a shame though, because the breakfast was brilliant. The right? full English was lovely, and you could get a small full English. Yeah. But like I say, the egg and cheese. Oh, yeah, they were to die for, weren't they? Yeah. So I hope I've got the recorded. Uh, should I shut it off now, do you think, for a minute? Wait until the tea. Yeah, goes. I would. All right, I'll shut it off for a minute and then we'll see how we go. We'll be back in a sec. Right, teas have arrived. So, um, yeah. Got a nice cup of tea. Yeah. First flush. Steamer. Yeah. Yeah, steamer's there. Makes up milk with some froth in. Where's the pot? Do you want my biscuit? Yeah. Hard luck. Hmm. <laughs> there you go. Alright, well, why not? Maybe you should That's a bit annoying, isn't it? What? That. Stir them Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. I'll take a pint. I don't apologise. <laughs> Stirring the milk bothers you. Uh, right, let's get this on the video. You need to put your coffee down because you can't get it on the, on the video. Oh, that's nice. Is it? <laughs> Could you pour me tea for me, please? <laughs> Yes, sir. Yes, can, yes, tea, yes sir. Of, yes, I please. know you like it wishy washy. Wishy washy, I like it wishy washy, yeah. Well, it's, is it wishy washy? No, that's wishy washy enough, enough yeah. <laughs> I was hoping for a bit of lemon, but I'm going to get a biscuit now. Don't you want that biscuit? No, <laughs> you don't have milk either. I'm sorry that mm. the teapot was spilled on the table. That's good. Let's do the. Uh, Let's do the uh, let's have a look at the uh, Right, we're doing well there, aren't we? Mm. And, uh, when, I, I when, we've had a, when we've had our food, you should show the viewers them that portrait of Elizabeth Bottom. Which one? On the back. That's not her, is it? I would imagine so. Well, you don't know, though, do you? But so we might be misleading our viewers. We might be saying this is. Heaven forbid we mislead the viewers. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Oh, it's a nice cup of tea, though. I didn't like it. You did ask for lemon, though. Yeah, I'll ask her when she comes over. <clears throat> um, yeah, I'm hoping I'm going to be able to patch all these in when I'm... It gets a bit awkward when I'm on my phone and all well, of that sort of business, you know? Anyway, if, if it's a pig's ear, it's a pig's ear. There's no I can do about it, is it? Anyway, I'll turn it off for now and we'll come back when... It's usually not a pig's Excuse ear, me. it's a dog's dinner. Dog's dinner, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think she's saying too much now. Yes, I like that. Foods are right there, yeah. Pork pie, bit of salad and onion marmalade to go with it. Mrs M's got... What's in yours, Mrs M? Uh, cheese and beans. In what sort of bread is that? Uh, granary. Granary, looks lovely. Looks nice, that. Good choice. <laughs> Enjoy. I'll cut into pork pie and show our viewers how different these pork pies are. <clears throat> I'll do one else so they can see they are. Looks different, doesn't it? Honestly, these are gorgeous. Really gorgeous. It's a different way that they cook them. But the pastry on these is to die for. Let's get... Oh... Let's get a bit of marmalade, marmalade. Do you remember when we went in that place and that bloke kept saying to you, do you want marmalade? And you couldn't understand what they were on about. I had a very strong Liverpool <laughs> accent. 
It's really nice as that can. It's fruity. Plenty. I normally like this mustard on it though. Right. <coughs> what do you think to that? I think it's absolutely delicious, but everything always is here. Mm. I agree. It is nice, yeah, it's always nice. That's it really, mate, isn't it? Uh, Right, we need to get a wristband hidden somewhere, so uh, I'll finish my lunch and uh, we'll see you at wristband. Thanks for watching. See you in a second or two. That was absolutely lovely, yeah. Those pork pies, but that onion marmalade, honestly, fantastic. Right, I'm going to show you where I've hidden where I've hidden the wristband. I'm right at the end of Skinner Street and I'm going to twizzle my camera around, show you exactly where we're located. Right. We're outside this place, which is the Church House Centre at the end of Skinner Street. It's been sold, I don't know what it's going to be converted into, but anyway. And if you look up here, um, there's one of these Walk With Heritage people. And if you look, this lady's doing a bit of knitting, and if you look, there's a ball of wool there and there's a wristband right behind it so i hope you find it yeah squeeze it in yeah <laughs> it's right behind it you can just about see it right that's it mates let's twizzle this round say goodbye to our friends three times three times a lady right that's it mates thanks for watching i'll try and cobble this together and get it posted up tonight if not i'll put it up tomorrow night thanks for watching thanks for your subs thanks for your likes all of that business much appreciated i'll be seeing you chin chin